the 90s, the strutting, the catwalk, the joyfulness of this runway. Oh my goodness. I just felt so happy watching the Chanel Spring Summer 2022 runway. I love that they took us back to the 90s, supermodel vibes. So let's dive right into the collection. I have seen so many, so many things that I love that I would love to get my hands on. So I'm going to share my screen with you and I'll go through the collection with you at the same time. And if you're new to my channel, I would love for you to subscribe. My name is Amy, by the way, if you're new here. If you haven't seen the runway already, I will link to it down below in the description. Definitely watch the video itself. It's so joyful. It's such a beautiful collection. These sunglasses are just so cool. The fact that it's black and white and there's this big signature quilted white arm. Right off the bat, just the sunglasses are fire. Of course, I love all the accessories that Chanel does on their models, especially this belt. And you guys know how much I love my Chanel belts. This little thin belt right here is so similar and reminds me of the one that I already own, except that mine is not in the right size for my waist. So I might still try to get my hands on one of these. It does come in a black and a white. Uh, as you will see in other models, loving the little flats and all the swimsuits that we're going to be seeing. Again, same super on fire sunglasses. Love them. Love that choker moment. Again, the same, same belt. And oh my goodness, look at this cute swimsuit. It's just simple with black and white, a little bit of CC logo. I just feel like even if you're not going to wear it as a swimsuit, you could wear it underneath a blazer in the summer if you're really daring. I mean, I would do that if I was vacationing. Use it as a sports bra even so you get more cost per wear. Anyway, it's just a cute, cute little swimsuit. Love the monogramming CC logo on the sandals. The headband is back, guys. This is so cute. Let me just grab mine. This is the one that I have from a few seasons ago. Just so cute and classic. This one is absolutely beautiful. Last swimsuit was so cute, but this one is just uber cute. This one especially because it has a lower rise, it would work better on my petite frame. She kind of has more of a rectangular body shape, so it looks more like my own body shape to begin with. Another choker, this time with a little um, bow detail. All the chokers from this season are just absolutely stunning. Again, they're coming back with their perfume bottles. We're going to also see that in their handbags very soon. The micro bags, they're not going anywhere. And again, a cute little swimsuit moment. Uh, if you just buy the swimsuit and wear it as a bodysuit, why not? Just get more cost per wear with it. This bag is just so cute. I wonder how much it will cost. Let's take a closer look at it. It's all pearls. It's micro size. It has a turn lock. I'm sure this one will be super popular, but we'll see how much it is. Brand new seasonal bag with super chunky chain. I think it's cool. Love this belt as well. I have an elastic belt myself that is so easy to style. They work very, very well with trousers as long as you don't mind the big CC logo. Mine is a bit more blingy and probably even larger than hers. Uh, so it just depends on your outfit, but Again, loving the general vibe of this collection, loving the biker short moment, especially the chokers. I just can't get enough. These earrings that she's wearing, on fire. Again, more headbands, more chokers, just very 90s, more platforms. I used to have shoes like these that I bought from Pegabo when I was in, I wanna say I was like in either high school or Cégep. Um, I wore these kinds of platforms to death and I just felt so cool in them. I just loved the 90s fashion so much, obviously because I grew up in that era. This coat is so cute. Love the oversized easy going vibe with just, you know, very simple platform and a few accessories. It just looks so good. More oversized relaxed coat jacket in black and love this choker oh my goodness if i can get my hands on this choker or any of the chokers for that matter because i don't know why it is that our store doesn't ever carry any chokers or maybe they're always sold out maybe they have maybe they do have them but maybe they only have one or two and they're always never available but yeah these shoes again i love these shoes um i'll definitely have to give them a try when it comes out 
because I love that they are slip-on, but it still has that little strap detail to hold on to your feet, which is essential for me. It has that sort of more architectural shape on the heel, which is still chunky, but has more of an interesting shape, which I personally love the chunky chains again on the seasonal bag. So it's gonna be interesting to see uh, how these bags look in person. Love this necklace on her, so chunky and so cool. Again, this uh, little gold top, I wonder if it's even a swimsuit. Love how Chanel always gets you with their accessories, but that's why Chanel collections are always so fun and just they are just fashion. They are so fashion forward. It may appear to be more trendy, but as long as you pick right to incorporate into your own wardrobe, then that's what it matters, right? Again, more of that black and gold look. Loving, loving everything I see so far. This choker is more simple with a round CC. Kind of has that more of a vintage vibe. Like I said, chokers for this season is so super strong. Back in high school uh, for my grad, I um, had this dress that I bought from Le Chateau and um, I didn't find any jewelry that I liked, so I just made my own choker. And people were very, very intrigued as to where I found that piece of costume jewelry, but I just made it myself. I either made a black band or I bought a black choker that was just like basically a black fabric. And then I just made my own dangling charm that would dangle all the way here, which was the coolest thing. Everybody was asking me where I got it because obviously it was not sold. I made it myself, right? More chokers, of course but look at this micro heart bag. It has a turn lock, flat pocket in front. It has a zipper closure. This collection is gonna be super exciting, probably gonna be very hard to get hot items that a lot of us will try to get our hands on, especially on the heart bag, especially on the accessories, the chokers, the belts. This cool <laughs> novelty bag, which will probably cost an arm and a leg, the perfume a bottle, it's just stunning. Look at this heart bag. Isn't it gorgeous, guys? These heart bags will fly off the shelf. Of course, they will probably cost so much money. If LV made a heart bag that everyone went crazy for, imagine Chanel, right? The heart-shaped bag in pink. Oh my goodness, I, I just... I think we're all gonna die over this heart-shaped bag. Even the one behind her. It is a nano size, so maybe it's not gonna be as popular, but who knows, right? Again, more chokers. So yes, this bag does come in more than just the micro size, which means this bag will also be <laughs> very, very hard to get and who knows how much, but definitely an item to keep an eye on, especially if you're after novelty pieces. More of the same choker. I guess this choker will be very popular because it comes in all the colors. It comes in just plain gold, white, blue, now pink. I think we saw yellow earlier, right? And then look at this little bag on her wrist. The heart bag on the wrist. Oh my goodness, this is, this is extra novelty. Another headband right here. It looks like it's Similar to this version, does it have a CC? I don't see a CC on it, but it's just basically um, the white with intertwined metal. I love this whole uh, coordinated ensemble. This model is extra cute, has beautiful curves. Loving the 90s, you know, very logo forward moment with her choker and her matching shoes. Just stunning, and then of course the pearl bag. On this model, I love the CC plastered on her dress. It looks like it's like a, it looks like some sort of denim or canvas material, and it's very cool. I actually really like that. Yeah, it looks, it looks kind of denim-ish. It has a bit of structure on it. I just think it's so, it's so cool. I, I really love, um, I really love this fabric. It's very much in your face, especially in this jacket. I guess this would be another version of the perfume number no. five handbag. Very novelty. Mm, so nice. Love her dress too. I love this look. Not that I would wear it myself because I don't have the body length. I feel like if you're very tall and lanky, then it looks so good on you. But I just love this whole leather moment with choker, matching bag. 
such a good look, right guys? I woke up that morning watching the show over and over and looking at photos and close-ups of this collection because it was just absolutely stunning. Let me know what you think about this collection if you've loved it as much as I did and if you're gonna try to get your hands on anything from this collection. Towards the end of the show, they kind of get a bit more ethereal, maybe more sort of like that flowy material, uh, which of course is still beautiful, but definitely the eye-catching moment is always at the beginning of the show. Again, if you're brand new to my channel, I would love to have you back. Please don't forget to subscribe, like this video if you've enjoyed it. You can also support me by becoming a channel member and get exclusive access to more live stream content every single month. Thank you so much and I'll talk to you guys again very soon. Bye!